Also this noontime, gun violence across the United States is now being labeled a public health crisis. The announcement coming from the Office of the U.S. Surgeon General, who's citing statistics that shows gun violence is now the leading cause of death among teenagers and children. Natalie Brand has more from Washington, D.C. With too many summer weekends ending with a staggering tally of shootings across the U.S., the nation's top doctor, Vivek Murthy, says enough is enough. Gun violence is a public health crisis in our country that requires a public health solution. The Surgeon General is making this first of its kind declaration with firearms now the leading cause of death in children and teens, while more than half of adults say they or a family member have experienced a gun-related incident. Following the massacre at Robb Elementary School in Uvalde, Texas, that killed 19 children and two adults in 2022, Congress passed bipartisan gun safety legislation, the first major federal bill to address the issue in 30 years. But since then, additional measures have stalled in a divided Congress. Dr. Murthy says it's time to take the issue out of politics. The good news is there's a lot we can do. There are, for example, community violence intervention programs that we can invest in. There are safe storage education programs that we can expand. There are firearm risk reduction strategies like background checks. And gun violence is taking a toll on the nation's mental health, according to the Surgeon General, with nearly 80 percent of adults saying they stress about the possibility of a mass shooting and half of the country's children worried about a shooting in their school. He's also calling for doctors to promote gun safety education during regular visits. 